Hey guys, I'm Gamer Mate. Welcome back to a new video. In today's video, I'm going to be showing you how to create your varying kills and deaths to the stats. So let's get into the video. So the first thing you need to do is click Serve Script Service, click Plus, and then add in a script. Once you have your script, we can click it, go to Properties, and then change the name of it. So then we can name this to Leader Stats, like this. And then side of script, we can scroll in, remove print hello world, and then type in game dot players dot player added colon connect two brackets and then function. Then once again two more brackets. And between them we can type in player and then go down. Then once we've done that, we can type in local leader stats equals to instance dot new two brackets and then we can type in speech marks and then folder like this then in between brackets and the speech marks we can do a comma space and then player then if we go down and type in leader stats dot name equals to and then speech marks and then we can type in leader stats all in lowercase so no capitals go down twice so we can type in local kills equals to instance dot new two brackets speech marks and then we can type in number value so once again in between brackets and speech marks we could do a comma space for this time we can type in leader stats like that go down and type in kills dot name equals to speech marks and then we can type in kills like that go down once again type in kills dot value but this time we'll do equals to zero go down twice and then we can type in local local deaths equals to instance dot new two brackets two speech marks and then we can type in number value once again in between the speech marks and brackets we do comma space and then leader stats go down do deaths dot name equals two and then speech marks then once again deaths then deaths dot value equals to zero then once again go down then we can type in player dot character added colon connect then two brackets then function two more brackets and then character go down then a new entry should appear with a bracket then we type in local humanoid equals to character colon find first child and brackets and speech marks then we can type in humanoid and then go down also make sure humanoid has a capital H now we can type in humanoid dot died colon connect and once again two brackets function and then two more brackets then we can type in died go down and then type in deaths dot value equals to deaths dot value plus one then if we go down and type in local tag equals to humanoid colon find first child brackets and speech marks and then we can type in creator with no capitals so make sure it's like this go down and then type in local killer equals to tag dot value then go down and if we type in if tag and killer then go down now we type in killer dot leader stats colon find first 
child, brackets and speech marks, and then type in kills dot value equals to then killer dot leader stats colon find first child brackets speech marks then kills dot value plus one like this then that should be your entire script done so if you close it off and then click play so once we load it into the game and you can see that in the top corner we have our kills and our deaths so they're both on zero so if you go over to this person and kill them then you can see that we get one plus kill for me and then one plus death for them okay and guys so that's going to be it for today's video if this video helped make sure to leave a like comment and subscribe down below in the description you can check out my robots group and discord server and i'll see you later bye